Hey what's up guys, I'm back here with another episode of best android apps for this month. Make sure to check out our previous episodes and without any further ado, let's begin. Starting off with floating stickies. This is a simple yet a very useful application. You can simply launch the app to quickly note down on the sticky note. This widget will stay on top of all the screens and you can place it anywhere you want. You can resize it, minimize the sticky notes and also have as many sticky notes as you want. Each sticky note have different color, making it easier to differentiate your notes. If the floating sticky is bothering you, you can easily dismiss it from the notification panel and all the notes are saved when you close them. This app is very handy when you have to note down few points from any article, a list of items from any messages or few contact numbers. Next up is Droid Optimizer. With most Android devices, as you use different applications, you will have cache and temporary files taking up your valuable memory and degrading your user experience. For this very issue, Droid Optimizer is one of the best tool I have used in recent times. It helps me monitor my RAM, storage, background running applications, battery status and many more. The One Touch Speed Up tool helps me free memory easily. And like I said earlier, I can clear my junk files, temporary files with ease. You also get variety of widgets to perform different actions with a single tap. So a great app to optimize your device. Next up is Instadict. This is a dictionary application. All you have to do is copy the text, shake your phone and there you have it. From the app, you can change the definition timeout, shake strength, languages, etc. So a very useful app or let's say add-on when you are browsing the web or reading email as you can instantly find the word meanings. The next one here is the dock for Droid. This app will bring a dock on the side of your screen with 5 recent apps as you can see here. You can easily switch between your recent apps with a simple gesture. This dock will stay on top of all the other apps and to disable this you have a quick settings on your notification panel. Launching the app will give you different settings for your dock. You can choose positions, number of recent apps, choose shortcuts, contacts or actions to show on the dock. Change the appearance of your dock and other settings. So a great app for multitasking. Next one is ADB Screen Recorder. It's a great screen recording app which does not require root access and it's free. Simply launch the app, hit the shutter button and then tap the camera icon. And now you can start recording the screen. Once you are done, you can pause or stop the recording from the notification panel. And then again you have the trim options to export the video. So as you can see, the recording ran very smoothly. No glitches or lag. From settings, you can choose the video resolution, bitrate, frames per second, audio settings if you want to record the audio as well, camera settings and many more. So a perfect screen recorder. Last but not the least is the Discovery VR. So for all those who are into virtual reality or own a VR, it's a great app for you. I will leave links to some affordable VRs in the description if you are interested. This app basically gives you VR contents categorized into various sections like adventure, shows, planets, etc. You can select any of the content and enjoy. By default, the video will play in 360 degree view. And tapping this cardboard icon here will turn the video into the VR mode. 
So that's all for this video guys, I hope you found this video useful. I will be coming up with the top 10 apps you should install very soon. Stay tuned for that and I'll catch you guys in the next one.